Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, Essence of Shay. I know I haven't been on YouTube in so long and a bunch of you guys are probably, uh, if you didn't see my last video, I'm eating, I don't know if you can see it, but I'm eating Captain Crunch. I haven't been here in so long and a bunch of you guys are, if you didn't see my last video, you probably don't know probably my action on this thing but you probably don't know what's been going on but <clears throat> i um moved out of my grandmother's house um the initial plan was to move in with my mom but now i am here in dallas texas um it's brand spanking new like you could see like my garbage is hanging from the door there are still like clothes and whatnot seems wherever i go the ambulance is still in the background making noise come on <laughs> anyways uh so i just wanted to sit here and have a little heart to heart with you guys and <clears throat> tell you what it is and what's changing because things are changing honey and I hope you guys are down for the ride anyways so um I initially moved in with my grandmother uh I think after she got sick um one of the reasons was because she got sick but another reason was because I financially could not afford to stay on my own so I stayed with my grandmother and while staying with my grandmother is was pretty cool because me and my grandmother are like super close like that's my road dog for life there was family who lived in the same house as me who seemed to have like a real issue and vendetta with the relationship with me and my grandmother so they would do everything in their power um to try to get me out or to try to make me feel uncomfortable and so that happened for like two or three years i have been dealing with that like they would call the cops on me they would call the city and say that i was abusing my grandmother meanwhile i was the one who would make sh me and my uncle would want to make sure that she ate on a regular basis and that she was good and this is the person who had like all her credit cards and i'm spilling all the tea but whatever um <laughs> so push came to the shove is that uh something really bad happened in a family and I with my mom decided that it was just time to go um, my initial thing was to move to Atlanta um, but an opportunity came up so I just moved to Dallas instead mm -mm -mm -mm. The last video that I did, I discussed um, taking a 21 day break from all social media. This video um, is just to keep you guys afloat as to what has been going on and also to let you know the change that is going to happen on my channel and me having my aha moment. Um, <clears throat> so the reason why I took the 21 days is because uh, when I first moved out here to Dallas I just had like a mental breakdown like I walked into the apartment I fell on my knees and cried and it was like a grateful thankful cry but it was also like a cry like son you're by yourself this is the first time in your 34 years of life that you're actually by yourself my security blanket is no longer here with me everything is me i do not have anyone here none of that stuff it's just me but the goal is to to um work full-time as my brand 
and not work for anyone else. But until then, you like, you know, like you're thinking in your head, like, but you, that's going to happen. You see that in your future. There's no if, ands, or buts about it. But you still have to pay your bills. So I'll, um, I've been applying to jobs and doing all that stuff. <clears throat> Anyways, so. I just had a really mental breakdown and then I looked on Instagram and I was just seeing everybody getting married, all these people traveling, there's these girl trips, these friendships that are thriving, these businesses, small businesses that are thriving and then I'm just looking at my life like, yo, you are 34 years old, guy. What do you have to show for it? That's how I was looking, right? Like you, you're not engaged, you're not married, you don't have a kid, you don't have a car anymore, um, and all these. I was just thinking, that I don't have, I don't have, I don't have, I don't have, and it's just like, it just broke me down. So I was like, I cannot look at this stuff anymore because now what's happening is I'm comparing my life to them, right? And that's. You can't do that. This cereal is bomb. I decided to take 21 days off of Instagram. So I deleted the app. I did not delete the the, the page. I ain't that crazy. But I deleted the app. And I also made an um, impromptu video on my YouTube channel telling you guys that I was going to take 21 days off. Um, to just collect my thoughts and really find my purpose and what makes me happy and all this stuff. So here we are. <clears throat> we are still in Dallas. We are eating Captain Crunch honey. We are in better spirits. We have found our purpose and our purpose is, I wrote it down. I want to tell you what it is. Hold on. My purpose is to bring smiles and positivity to everyone's life while still educating on the importance of self-care, self-love, and being fulfilled, which I have been doing, but I've only been dedicating it to law care. And you guys always say that, Shay, you are so funny, but you inform us. And you guys nail it right on the head because that's sincerely what I want to do in life sincerely what I want to do and like that is my passion that is what I've been trying to do but I've been so scared to do it because I was so used to the little lock hair cocoon and I and I didn't want to branch out because I didn't want you guys to not support me or I didn't want it to fail so it scared me into doing it and I didn't do it but now I'm here to say that this channel is still going to talk about lock hair that's what's on top of my head. I can't run from it. And I'm, but I'm going to incorporate just like self love and self care and how to get it and finding your purpose and um, money management and all this stuff that helps you to become a better you. This is what this channel is now going to focus more on cooking and all that stuff. I'm going to do like vlogs I'm so washed out on this thing I'm gonna do vlogs uh, on my experience in Dallas um, so far Dallas has been really rainy and cold like I could just stay in New York <laughs> but um but that's gonna be like on my second channel I believe crazy thing is that I spoke about all of this before, like last year or the beginning of this year. Like, oh, I want my channel to turn into a lifestyle channel, but I noticed people weren't connecting with it, so I let that stop me from doing it. And that has been kind of like the thing that I would do. If friends didn't agree with it, if family didn't agree with it, if the supporters didn't agree with it, I just didn't do it. So I just knocked it before I even tried it to see if it would even be successful. So we're not going to do that anymore. I'm learning to 
this whole experience is teaching me to just kind of like depend on myself um not others uh know my strength and my passions <clears throat> i've been reading think and grow rich i've been writing in my journal every day i've been watching a bunch of positive stuff that have been helping me change my mindset and educated me so i can educate y'all so yeah um i hope you guys are excited for this new change in the game honey i'm still waiting on like my box with all like my hair care and stuff so um that's annoying because my hair is dumb dry boy like she is dry honey but this light it is everything boo <laughs> yes um i'm gonna do an apartment tour it is a mess in here but i'm gonna do an apartment tour to show you where i am resting my head i have no bed i've been living on the ground child my back has been hurting honey she ain't young like she ain't a spring chicken like she used to be boo boo mm. anyways um yeah so i love you guys for watching uh don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you're with me on this journey and I will see you guys in the next video. I haven't done this in so long. <laughs> see you later, Tiger Lily. Toodles. Did y'all miss that part? Because I missed it. Okay, bye. Uh, crash course. Let me hide the money in the dashboard. Max mad, could you lost the brick inside the Porsche? Goofy with the curb.